Hey there, it's Sam here with another awesome Minecraft seed adventure. This is seed seven forward slashes. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven forward slashes are the name of the seed. You spawn just here on a bit of grass. If you come south, really close by, you've got a desert temple. Uh, there's a dungeon in the middle of the desert, really easy to find, but we're going to jump right here now to have a really, really cool look at a really cool thing. Now, I think this looks a little bit like the Millennium Falcon. Ah, you have to have a look at the right angle. But what's cool about it is there's still some loose bits of sand. So if we accidentally go... Oh, my bit's not going to work. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. I'm going to... Oh! Whoa! Isn't that cool? Loads more of that to do. Um, so And then what's some really, really other cool bits on this seed. If we're now here, if we move over, we've got some really, really cool, really cool mountains there. But on the way, we're going to visit here and here for a couple of dungeons. So we have now zoomed here the first one's a little tricksy to find if you find the river you get the flat bit there you come along to the very very edge of this mountain and there's a little hole down there and if you look carefully you'll see there's the wall of a of a dungeon and there's some cool <coughs> stuff in here uh, i'll let you guys explore that yourself uh, pretty close to it there's another exposed dungeon on the edge of this bit of savanna. Come on, that's pretty easy to find because there's just a hole in the side of the desert. But there's even cooler stuff because there's a truly awesome savanna M. It goes up pretty darn high and there's some awesome parkour opportunities from the very, very top. So if we come up, find the highest point, which is over here, on the edge of the mesa. Let's do a little bit of... Ah, oh, that's just too inviting. Let's have a look. Am I going to survive? We are just... Ah, oh, oh. No, that would have killed me. That would have killed any normal person if it wasn't on creative. This is a really, really cool, it's not far from spawn, it's a really, really cool area to explore, to look around, and there's a huge village not too far to the south of it. Just come along here and you'll see it's a big village with a, a blacksmith. And as you can see, it's nearly in sight of those big hills. Uh, really, really cool. Let's just have a look, see what we've got in here. Come down. What are those sheep doing up there? And what have we got in this? Ah, okay, some pretty cool stuff in there. Uh, then we're going to go back to the map. Ah. So, we are now in this village. Blacksmith, and it's right by a really pretty area of Bryce Mesa. So we have a Bryce Mesa village. That is really, really awesome. It would be even more awesome if they brought gold, gold mines into Mesa on Minecraft. Um, but again, it's really, really now going to do is jump from this village uh, 
past here there's a stronghold just here up on the end of this this mesa we're going to come onto the edge of this mushroom area just here it's going to be pretty cool So here we are, we, we're in that village, we're now going to zoom up and jump over. There is actually a really cool temple on that lake there. There's another temple up here on the coast. So we're going to zoom past those up into this cool ice spike area here, which again is definitely worth seeing. So we're now at 1200 minus 1660 and we're having, look, there's... These are actually pretty nice, these ice spikes. There's some nice tunnels to look at. And what's really cool is if you dig down, so if we look, we're right on the edge of this, this river. If you dig down on the side, I think it's here. Down on the side of here, underneath one of these, there's a huge cave. I think I've chosen the wrong one. Let's have a look. Maybe it's on the side of this one. Yeah, that looks a bigger one. So if we dig down here, yeah, and I've not seen that before. The ice spike propagates all the way down into the earth and down into this huge, huge cave system. That's just, just really, really cool. Uh, there's another one more thing I want to show you on this one. If you come out of the ice spikes, follow the river out into the tundra, and you will find a lake, uh, a frozen lake. Uh, am I following the wrong river? I think I'm following the wrong river. Um, so if we come out here, yes, it's over this way. So go past the really tall, the really tall one. And there's a dungeon that I was going to say is really easy to find, but uh, <laughs> I couldn't find it. So if we look at this lake here, the, the grey one on the left, just by the oxbow of the, the river, see just past it, so you can see where we are in relation to the to there, go down into this, this little cave here, and there's a really easy to find dungeon. Some diamond horse armor, definitely worth getting. A disc, uh, some pretty, pretty nice stuff. Uh, now, from here, we are going to going to explore out from Spawn, which was here. There's some lovely islands here. We've got flower islands there. There's an underwater thing here. There's a cave here I want to show you, and there's an exposed stronghold uh, portal room on there so we're going to come down onto these islands next now these are actually nice little islands a little archipelago you could create you know, a beautiful hotel here or some some other cool things but you've always got to watch out because you might be zapped by the lasers from the uh, underwater guys down here and then away in. We pop over onto this little island. Right at the end, there's a huge hole, which if we're going to fall down, there's a little alleyway here that we can explore, which takes you right to a cool a pretty cool route. Uh, if we come back up, to explore down there. If we carry on in this direction, we'll soon come to another island.
and on the edge of this is the stronghold but it's a stronghold that's rendered you might just be able to see through the water no this is where I've actually got the wrong island no I think it's the right island I've already been here just so that I could find where it is and you can see underneath down there somewhere we have okay I've put, I've put all the light there but we've got the portal room go inside there we go we can go all the way to the end okay okay so we're in the portal room here we're now going to do a huge journey just have a look at the last couple of cool stuff on this seed if you come all the way down here yeah it's a bit of a trek it's a bit of a trek but there are a couple of seaside there's a couple of seaside uh, jungle temples here and here so we're going to just finish off this seed by having a look at the seaside temple here uh, actually we'll just have a look at this one so we'll see you down there and then it'll be goodbye if it's awesome seven forward slash seed absolutely awesome so as we watch the sun set on this awesome seed we can see there's a hovering temple right on the edge of this beautiful ocean great well i hope you really enjoyed this um it's been a really really great seed to play with uh as as you can see it's a huge huge area um lots lots more to explore but the good stuff's not that far from spawn uh really enjoy enjoy remember if you want to see any more pound that like button follow uh comment be great i'd love to do more of these and have a really good one see ya